good chaotic nation and it's your boy chaos here we are back with some more of the emerald randomizer nuzlocke episode number 15 if you missed the last episode spoiler already you're spoiled already let me say stuff correctly because we got red claw the I almost said gerardo does red claw the rayquaza on the team white smoke prevents ability reduction that's actually pretty pog that's um uh Twerkle has that ability i believe i didn't check the ability last time i don't think and we've got the experience share, so Red Claw's going to be getting some levels as we move forward um, in this playthrough. We're going to be getting levels in general on this route here, so let's get into it with this first trainer battle. I will be honest, I was a little bit scared when I started the recording process today. Um, because I opened up the ROM and it was saved at the last station. Um, it was saved two episodes ago when we were in Lava Ridge City and we only had two gym badges. So I was like... I don't have to redo all of that, but we didn't have to. Luckily, I had a save state, so that was fine. Also, before you got commented, yeah, I'm drinking Gatorade today. Leave me alone. <laughs> no. It's just, there's not a lot of options at the store I go to because it's like a local store. So there's not a lot of options for like beverages. So it's like, here's a bunch of soda and then that's about it. So I usually get Gatorade and lemonade. Or my two go-to's from that place, so. Um, so yeah. I know I'm not drinking G Fuel. I had a bunch of G Fuel ready today. Wasn't feeling like G mashing through all the G Fuel. But essentially what today's episode's gonna be is um, dealing with all of these trainers. We are a little bit underleveled with the team overall. Um, and also trying to... Wow, that's, that's fun. And also trying to level up... Um, the, uh, the, 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 the Rayquaza as well is going to cost us some issues throughout the series. So trying to get um, trying to get some experience on the team as we level up. So today's episode is going to be a little bit more of a battle everybody we can possibly battle episode, which is cool. Um, Gap's leading the charge right now. I'm not sure what Winona's levels are. I think she's mid 30, so the team is pretty pretty good level wise but um the more of this is just to train up our last team member um as well so we're just getting some training in i'm gonna try to mix the levels around the the regular team as best i possibly can um so that's the cool thing also this double battle was just completely out of like why would you even place this here you literally have to go out of your way to get into this double battle. Um, and just so I have it in the way I want to have it, I'm going to put Rayquaza in the second spot so that way I can switch it out. You literally have to go out of your way to fight these two. Silcoon and Lunatone. Alright, I definitely want to switch both of them out. Uh, I would have no issue staying in if it wasn't a Lunatone, but it's a Lunatone and it could have Psychic at level, no, at level 25. Just a little bit worried with that, so I am going to switch out. We'll put Truck and Princess in. We're a rock type now. I'm going to Surf, and I'm going to... I think I'm going to... I'm going to Ice Punch in the Lunatone. I'm not too worried about the Sokun. I just want to get the Lunatone off the field. I want to see if I'm correct with Surf only hitting one of your teammates. Not even hitting your teammate. Yeah, that's right. I'm gonna be honest, Lunatone's not a bad option right now. Alright, we're gonna Surf, and I'm gonna switch Truck out to Red Claw just to get some more experience. Because, uh, I know it's a little bit weird of a, of a switch here, but... The scary Pokemon goes down, which is the Lunatone. And so if they do have anything in the back, I get more experience for Ray with Rayquaza being a member of the battle. So... That's why I'm switching it back in. It's also level 9. It's going to take a little bit to get this Rayquaza up to par with the team. Just because legendary Pokemon are pretty difficult to level up. That is a huge power Swalot. We are in, not in a good spot. That is... Oh my gosh. We are... This is... Okay, this is why we don't do this battle stuff. Because um, this is absolutely terrifying. How do I even fight this? Huge power. Man. Gerard, I mean... Is it going to have good moves? Maybe not. Do I send in Charizard? 
I'm gonna send in Charizard to help deal with this Dorachi. I'm just hoping I'm just hoping that you don't have a poison type stab move. Oh why? Please just one shot it. Please one shot it. Please Kingler. Please one shot. Oh crit. That crit saved my life. That crit saved my life. Cause that something was dying. I don't care. That's a huge power small lot with helping hand. Something was dead. Alright, don't have levitate. It don't is it choice scarf? Do this. This Jirachi could be choice scarfed. It'd be crazy. Also, please don't have levitate. Okay, cool. Alright, scary situation avoided. Crisis averted. That was absolutely terrifying. Huge power small out with helping hand is actually busted. I didn't realize Princess is kind of underloved for the team. I mean, it did sort of become an HM slave, so... Not the best thing in the world, but hey. Um, also, the good thing about doing all this is... Um, doing all of this gives us some money, so we don't we can get, like, Pokeballs and stuff for encounters. Um, at this section of the game, there's so many encounters we can get. We got our encounter on 105, we have an encounter on 108, which is uh, right before Slateport. Where the sunken ships and stuff are. So we can actually do some of that too. Um, and then we have... We have encounters as we go towards... Um, encounters as we go towards... Um, Winona's Gym and Fort Tree. I was trying to think of what the city was. I couldn't think of what it was. But I know I didn't get... I know I skipped the encounter east of Mauville. Because I didn't want to fish it. So we have that encounter. We have the new Mauville encounter as well. Which I plan on doing. Um, there's our. We could add a level 30 Rayquaza. That would have been great. We can't escape. Let's get scary face. All right, we're just gonna fight it because why the heck not? I didn't get a. That's gonna be terrifying. Oh, we take it. So the good part is we know Rayquaza gets dra gets Dragon Claw at some point in the game. That's nice to know. It's not nice to know that this thing is gonna absolutely body me if I don't be careful. You have a lot of health, don't you? Actually, an 80. Do I have a... If I have um, lemonades, that'd be great. I don't think I have any. I'm just gonna use the Moomoo Milk then. Better be safe than sorry. Oh, freaking heck, dude. Get out of here. Uh, he wasted the time. He got he got greedy. Double Dragon Danced. Dude, why could I have not caught a level 30 Rayquaza instead of a level 8 Rayquaza? Oh, uh, I wouldn't have even tried. I would have just chucked the Master Bomb and done with it. The good part is we see Dragon Rage. We see, um, not Dragon Rage. We see Dragon Dance and Dragon Claw via um, level up, which is really good. Which means that, like. Which allows. Ooh, Big Pearl. Money. Which allows us to have a really good offensive Rayquaza. Um. Of course, Dragon is special in this generation, that is something to note, even though Dragon Claw is a special kind of move. Um, it's cool that Swallot's on this route, too. Alright, this is the route north. We could have had a Nido King. We did not get a Nido King. Could have had one, though. Oh, I'm a body slam. You don't have any moves, you're gonna die. What's up, dude? Haha, <laughs> I'm a lousy runner, but in the water, you can't catch me. Uh, Marco Polo, son. I was gonna die, do a spit take if his name was Marco. Oh, he's got Dave. Yeah, what's going on, Dave? How you doing, my dude? Uh, let's just sludge Dave in the face. He is using Razor Wind. Interesting. Please one shot or poison. It's an Absol. It's not tanky. Absol is not tanky at all. Red Claw's level 15. Very nice. Learn Ancient Power, which is good because it's physical in this generation. Dude, I'm, I'm just imagining physical ancient power plus Dragon Age. Like, that'd be, that'd be kind of pog. Also, I want to know when I became the when I became Tobias, because, like, I have a Mew and a Rayquaza. Like, I don't know what my luck is with randomizers recently. Some of you, like, obviously, if you guys have watched the last two series, you know what that is. Like, Fire Red Leap Green versus with Tui. I had, uh, shout out my boy Tui, by the way. I expect you to comment, yo, thank you for the shout-out, or something like that. Um, that's how I know if Tubi watches this video. He'll, he'll thank me for the shout-out. Um, that's fun. 
Why not? It's cool. It doesn't have uh, shadow tags. That's fine. Get bodied. Actually, this is still kind of scary. Please one shot. Okay. Realized that it still had its same move set though. So it's a why not? It was gonna get one shot. Like, come on. Why are you? Why are you nervous about that? But if you saw the Fire Red Leaf Green versus, I had a Mew. Um, I had a pretty good team. Could have got a Porygon here. That would have been fun. Um, so I had that in Fire Red Leaf Green. I uh, caught it in a Pokeball. Same with this game, which is weird. Um, if you watched Colosseum, the randomizer in Colosseum, I had two Jirachis and a Rayquaza. So, kind of cool. Oh, Zangus would have been really awesome this early on. That would have been really cool. Of course, it goes for Swords Dance. Please one shot. It's a Zangus. It's going to die. Not tanky at all. Not tanky at all. Oh, boy. Oh, mama. I can hear... Speed tie! That's kind of pog. Speed tie. We win speed tie. That was good. Honestly, it's a Swalot. Toxic! He's becoming me! He's becoming me. Yeah, learn Toxic. Um, I can set up with Amnesia. Yawn is kind of my catching Pokemon move, but I think I want to give Toxic instead of Yawn. I think that's going to help us out in more situations. This might be a misplay and somebody timestamp this. I'm just kidding, don't actually. Uh, somebody refer me to this moment in the episode when uh, I regret getting away. Want to regret learning Toxic over, over Yawn because we're in trouble now. Because Yawn might force a switch. Toxic, eh. All right, so nothing here. We're in Doofer Town again. We might as well heal while we're here. Get some PP back. Hello, welcome to the Pokemon Center. Would you like to heal your Pokemon? No. I came for the free coffee. I heard there was a Starbucks. Just, just kidding. Just imagine May pops out of the walls like, What's up? I got a Starbucks, bro. Just look crazy. You guys love that accent. I appreciate you liking the accent. So what are we looking at so far? I'm definitely going to use Ancient Power over Twister. Hyper Fang Rock Smash, 30, 31, 29. Um, let's get Gap to 32. It's actually, I'm going to let Charizard do some work. I don't want to switch into Charizard as much. So that'd be cool. Uh, if I can get Charizard like Thunderbolt or something, that'd be great. Uh, we did have a 107 encounter because I fished off the side. So this is not a new route. I just dodged that trainer, did not even try. It's a Macargo. I'm gonna Macargo out of here. Because I ain't dealing with a rock type ancient power or something like that. It's gonna one shot me. That actually was kind of terrifying. I probably should have switched. Chloe's got a Magneton. See, this is why we have Charizard up front, bro. I wish you had Flamethrower. Which is kind of why you're up front, because I think you learned Flamethrower via level up at 32. Which would be great, because you kind of suck right now, buddy. Also, I was like, why did I not get paralyzed? I mean, why did I not get intimidated there? I'm like, oh yeah, different abilities. <laughs> different abilities. What do you got? What move are you going to use? Odor Sleep? Which doesn't make us a ground... Which doesn't make us a, uh, a ground type or anything. Or a normal type or anything. So. Oh, he lives on one. So now we're a fire type, which is cool. And I think I'm just going to... Cut. Finish you off, my dude. Yeah. If, once I get Rayquaza at like level 25, I'll feel comfortable leading with it. But until that point, I don't really want to lose it. Also, the likelihood of uh, something being able to beat my Rayquaza is kind of... Eh. Rayquaza is really good. Honestly. The best legendary in this game. The issue that it has is it doesn't have a great level up moveset, and it's also really weak Com compared to the rest of my team. Thanks for the T-Wave. I appreciate being in a really bad spot right now. Thank you. Freaking hate you, dude. Alright. Um, Sodi Pop, I have plenty of them. Heal up my Charizard. I think I have a potion somewhere. I don't. But I am going to run back to Duford. I'm glad that doesn't affect my, my runaway strats. I don't want to waste... Uh, I wanted to potion up just in case I got stuck somewhere. Um, but I don't have a really a good way to heal paralysis without using my lava cookie. And I only have one lava cookie, so... 
kind of conserving everything as I go. But, uh, I mean, we're so close, it made no sense to not do it. A double battle? We challenge you as brother and sister. Alright, you're gonna get bodied. Senior and Junior Nick and Stu. Interesting. With so many different, like, breath. There's, like, symbols, man. Alright, we're level 17. Sometimes you play... I you know I said level 25. I lied. Level 17 is good enough, apparently, for me. Level 17 is good enough for me. <laughs> I guess. Uh, try attack. Please hit the Charizard. Thanks. <laughs> Just like... Yeah, you can hit Charizard. That's fine. Dude, Rayquaza is power. I don't care what you say, my dude. Oh, he's got Wonder Guard. <laughs> that would be terrifying. I got the stat boost. Now that doesn't matter. Thank you, Rayquaza. All right, I want a Doduo. Can I get a Dodrio now? Dude, at that point, Blue Rip is off the team, my dude. I will take a Wonder Guard Dodrio because it's weak to what? Rock? It's not weak to fighting anymore, so it would be weak to Rock, Electric, and Ice, right? Yeah, it's th three weaknesses. That's that's kind of crazy. That's crazy. That is crazy, man. Bruh. I remember, like, it was like episode two. We were talking about Wonder Guard, um, Wonder Guard uh, Sableye, and this gen would be broken. And this is a uh, Drought Cacturn. I remember that one because this thing was uh, Rich Boy Dum Dums at the beginning of the game. I was like, lol, that's so bad. And then it's like growthing in my face, and I'm like, eh. Dude, I really want to use Cacturn. I love Cacturn. Such a cool Pokemon. That guy in the anime, I don't remember what his name was, but he had one that was awesome. Sunlight is strong. I'm still, I'm in Sunlight, so it should be boosted fire move. And it's level 20. It's got Nightshade, that's just 24 damage. We're fine. We're at 40. And I can just, yeah. Bye. What else? Nidoran male. Get body. Please just get to I just need you to get to 32, my dude. I will it I will be the only person I will not be the only person to admit it, but as an avid Charizard lover, I will admit that Charizard is kind of booty cheeks at points. Because it is quad weak to to fighting and it has really quad weak to fighting, quad weak to rock, and it has pretty bad defenses. Um so it can be a little bit of a struggle to use it. And I get that. But I love the thing so much that I, I use it every time I find one. We got an Iggly buff and a Rapidash. Um, Drizzle. Drizzle is not fun. So I am going to... Um, what is the Rapidash going to hit me with? Stomp, probably. Um, so I'm going to use Charizard to switch to Princess. And I'm going to use Red Claw to switch to... Uh, let's bring in Mew. Alright, you're lowering my attack stat, which is kind of bad, but I can surf your face. And, um, I'm gonna Mega Punch into the, the Rapidash spot, because I don't think it will die. Mostly because, um, we're, it's no longer stat- okay, it's dead. Never mind. Never, remember how I said it wasn't gonna die? Yeah. Mega Punch made sure of that. Alright, this Igly buff is 100% dead. You have no stats. I'm pretty sure EV Light's not in this game. <laughs> I could be wrong. Don't remember my uh, my items in different generations. I remember mechanics and not items. A little bit of a difference with those kind of things. I gotta lie, that was kind of a scary fight. How we doing? Pretty good. Serves as almost level 32. 108, so this is an encounter. And regardless, I want to put Gap up front. 108 encounter is a Gerardados. I'm not hacking, I promise. I promise I'm not hacking. Like, I know it looks that way, but I'm not. Um, um, uh, that's Toxic? T-Shock? That's doing not, that's doing quite a bit, actually. Let's Amnesia. So we can shut down your special side. He's roaring me out. No! F's in the chat. I got greedy. I got greedy. I did get greedy. Also, I didn't think he would have that one. 
29. Oh well. I would have loved to use a Raikou. I don't think I've ever used one. Mostly because the only game I've ever think I've caught Raikou in was Colosseum, and it was so late in the game that I just never used it. Also because um, I think I had an Ampharos by that time in most of my playthroughs, so yeah. <laughs> Wasn't going to trade that out. Was not going to trade that out. I could have had a Dito. I'm glad I got the Raikou, honestly. Ahoy there! You're going to the abandoned ship, you too, mate! Nah. I'm just kind of battling people. I can't go to the abandoned ship, but it's kind of useless. Because, um... Don't really have any... Dive to you, HM. I mean. Toxic. Toxic. Yeah! I'm toxic, bruh! I kind of, I'm going to be honest, I kind of want to switch into Rayquaza, but I also don't because I know you have Pursuit. That was a crit, so I probably would have died. Bro. So yeah, I'm going to heal, actually. He's going to Pursuit. He's just Pursuit. He's got crit. Do I have a potion? No. I have, um, Orin Berries, though. Why? I just- I'm trying to save PP. That's- that's why. I don't- I got two more- I got another route to go through still. So I'm trying to save PP. Also, I need to put Charizard back up front. Thank you for reminding yourself, Chaos. Good job, boy. Good, Chaos. That's a hidden item. Isn't it? No. I'm crazy. Abandoned ship. We do get an encounter in here, because it's technically a different place. If there are encounters in here. I kind of don't want to fight two people at once. Because I want to see what level... Alright, we're 25. 25. Okay, we're fine. Also, why is the background in this place a cave? This is the cave background. Why is that doing on a ship, dude? Learn Flamethrower, please. Please. You don't learn Flamethrower. You learn at 36? I guess it's 36. That's funny. Hello, Blastoise. Let's bring in Rip. I don't have. I'm gonna be honest. That Raikou was losing. That Raikou was kind of sad. Cause that would we really need a counter to electric to water types. That's not Charizard. <laughs> so I'm gonna be honest. That kind of did suck a little bit. But if I get like Thunder, like, getting Thunderbolt on Charizard would be really great. There's Dragon Claw. Okay, so now Rayquaza is more useful. Rayquaza is really more. So 25 is fine. You don't learn Flamethrower till 20, till 36 probably. Then I'm surprised you didn't learn Wing Attack then. But what could compel you to come here? Well, you were here and I had to find you. I just had to find you. I was gonna. I almost mud shot it, and I'm like, wait, it's a it's a flying type. Stupid. Don't you dare flinch hacks me to death. Bruh, come on. Thank you. Oh, you are so weak, dude. Truck, you're up. Bruh, he switch he played that. I got played. Put a coda in yourself because you got played. Alright, that's fine. Lower my attack stat, that's fine. I'm not I mean I am attacking you from the physical side right now, but. I'm planning on using Ice Punch whenever that freaking Crobat comes back in. Dude, I've never have seen NPCs switch out in the game until, like, Generation 6. So it's kind of cool to see him switching out in Generation, um, 3. But he knew I had, uh, he... I guess it predicted the Psychic type. And just like, yeah, dude. I don't know what that Charizard could the Charizard, the Charmeleon could have had at that level. I don't know. Thank you for registering me. Dude, I'm such a Gen 1-er. I, I opened the trash can. Alright, so that doesn't look like it should take you that. It looks like it should take you farther, but it doesn't. Fluffy tail. Very cool. Wow. I'm so, so grateful. Alright, let's... No, oh, that... Wrong game. Thought you could jump down. Storage. What's up, my dude? Quick battle. You have a Swalot. Yay. 
Please one shot. It's level two. Oh, we crit last time, didn't we? That's gonna lower your speed stat, but oh, that's fine. Just hit it. Just hit. Thank you. Dude, swallow it is terrifying now. I can't. I can't go. See a swallow. I'm like, eh, I'm dead. Dude, I really wish Kingler had Earthquake. Do you just have my team? Bruh? I'm locked in the color change, so... I'm locked in the EQ. I mean, Mudshot. Whatever it's called. I am not a ground type. And my Encore ends so I can surf and kill. Dang, son. Dang, son. Chaos, why are you doing this? You don't have to do all this. Yeah, I know. I'm sorry if you guys want, like, story mode stuff. It, we'll get back to it, I promise. Like, obviously I have to sort of progress through the game in order to complete this challenge. So, um, but I just want to do what I can here. Do what I can while I can. Also, this is where you get your encountering the main and ship, right? Yeah. There we go, encounter an abandoned ship is a Magmar. Dude, if Charizard goes down, bro, I'm fine with using the Magmar. Magmar's fire, dude, quite literally. Um, I'm a... My cut. That was a crit, and he lived on one. Good... Bad, bad news, that crit. Good news, it put him on one HP. So he's literally in the perfect range to chuck balls. So, um, other bad news is I can't not poison him now. So this is where Yawn would have come in effect. Yeah, I know. Don't I don't need to see the clip from earlier where I, I said I, I'm gonna regret not I'm gonna regret getting rid of Yawn. Let let me have this one, okay? How was I gonna beat that Umbreon if I didn't you know didn't do it? Uh, I kind of want to use a repeat ball, but I also want to keep I don't have any Ultra Balls. Oof. I don't think I can buy Ultra Balls yet. I kind of want to check the repeat ball just because it kind of matches the color scheme, but like... I also didn't want to ch chuck the... you know? You know? The Spitfire Pokemon! Um... The Spitfire Pokemon. I don't think anybody has Magmar now. By the way, you guys can get a ma channel mascot if you subscribe over on Twitch. Go over to Twitch. Uh, we've got the Spitfire Pokemon. Um, trying to think if there's an Apex Legend that has a Spitfire as like they're done. So I know what Mirage. Mirage is the wingman. No. Um, I'm just gonna call. How about we just call you Apex? We'll call you Apex. Apex the Magmar. That's good backup for Charizard because I. I never keep Charizard alive, so. Poke Doll, yo, we can, yo, we can skip the, uh, we can skip the ghost in the Pokemon Tower, and oh, we're not playing Red and Blue. Yay, it's a ship! Oh, I thought you were gonna battle me. A Sacred Ash, yo, are we getting Ho-Oh? I have to, I can sell that though. Empty. Why am I checking trash cans? It's obvious this isn't the place to check trash cans. Jeez. Oh, hey, what's up, girl? Boy? Sorry. You know, what's so funny about having my inner tube in the ship? Because it's inner tube. It's an inner inner tube, bro. Flareon, what's up, dude? Big fan, big fan. How about Surf? How about... Oh, he lives. Alright, I'm fire type now. You're, dead. You're a dead type now. You're a ghost type. There you go. Dead type. Wow, okay, that's good job. Guess that's one rip, rip. Oh, I walked right into that, bro. Legit walk straight into it. It's cool. Alright, something good for my Rayquake, please. It's a Pichu and a Shedinja. Okay, so Shedinja does not have Wonder Guard, which means it's absolutely stupid as a Pokemon right now. Um, so we're gonna Surf and we're gonna. I think I wanna switch Darting Claw to the front, actually. And we'll, we'll Dargon Claw into the, uh, what? The Pichu? I'm assuming the Pichu's gonna live. It does have Wonder Guard. Hmm. 
Interes interesante. Alright, you can't literally do anything, so use cut, because you're not getting ancient power. Did not realize Shedinja keeps Wonder Guard. I guess that's cool. I guess it's just a failsafe in the randomizer, so in case, like, you would find a Shedinja, it still has Wonder Guard and it's still not sucky. So. I guess that's what that's there for. What is this item? An HP up. Right. Thank you. I guess there's another double battle right here. So many double battles! And we were talking about that in another episode. But honestly, that's what makes me really love this game. Bro and... I know this, this is this is hilarious because it's like Alabama up in here, bro. Sorry if you're from Alabama. Cloister and... Uh, Ralligator. Okay, that's what I get for laughing at that. Uh, I have nothing to do with this, so... Charizard, you're in, bud. Um, what else do I- what do I use for this fight? I don't know. I am scared of an ice move. Alright, I think the shift is to do it this way. Charizard gap, water gun, withdraw. Oh god, no. Um, and I'm gonna- I'm up sludge. Push uses protect, that's fine. Lowers my defense, okay, that's fine, that's fine. Um, I'm gonna scratch, try to get rid of the Feraligator, and I'm gonna toss it in the Cloyster, who's gonna try to protect stall me. Because it's a freaking Cloyster. Please hit through, Gap. Come on, Gap. <sighs> Need you to land toxic, bro. Alright, um. I'm gonna heal. I'm a little bit nervous about you hitting yourself because you do a lot of damage. Feraligator's gone. Cloyster didn't heal itself. Protect itself. Oh, it does have Aurora Beam, so I was right to make that call. How about... Um... Okay. He's not protecting. I don't get it. Cloyster usually protects every other turn. Withdrawal is going to boost its physical defense, so that's not great. Um... I snap out of confusion and get sludged, so... That would do what a regular Swallow would do. That's not bad damage, actually. Now I have to Ember you in the face. Now you're probably going to protect. What? What is this clo- I don't get this Cloyster strat, man. I really don't. Right, Rayquaza is getting some levels. Rayqua this was a good episode for Rayquaza. It got a lot of levels. And I know it went over a little bit. But, um... Rowan Sisla, Alabama, crazy. Alright. We can continue exploring the ship. I don't remember how to- oh, oh, no, we can continue exploring the ship. I thought we were done, but I guess we can keep going. Storage key. Oh! Oh, I guess we'll, we'll finish up the ship in the next episode, so we'll just, uh, save here. Uh, but thank you guys for watching this episode. I you guys enjoying the series. Uh, we will get back to the game in a second, I promise. Because I know you guys like, Chaos, you're not showing us the game. We're just going around random places. But we'll continue on forward in the next episode. So I hope you guys are excited for that. Um, hit that like button if you are. Or if you enjoyed this episode, subscribe for more content from me. And feel free to go check us out on other places, including um, Discord, Twitter, and on Twitch. By the way, the PDL is back. If you guys haven't seen that announcement, you probably have a million times by now. I probably plugged it a lot. Um, but... If you guys would like to join, um, try next season, <laughs> I guess, because we should be done with the application process, so we should be drafting soon, so that'll be good, hoping to get that out by October, um, so hopefully all that works out, but as for me, uh, I'm gonna wrap it up here, thank you guys for watching this episode, again, I hope you enjoyed, and until next time, my name is Chaos, and I am signing off, stay safe, and as always...